Hi, I'm Steve Shantfield. I'm the lands manager for the local area here. And I have the privilege of working in the eastern slopes west of Rocky Mountain House. And we're out here today at Rocky Creek. Uh, Rocky Creek, we did a restoration project of the stream. Um, and one of the reasons why we did the restoration project of the stream is we had multiple crossings on here from OHVs and other traffic as well. And it was causing sedimentation to the stream which has an impact on our fish populations. So every year since uh, we conducted the reclamation here on Rocky Creek, we've come back and, and looked at the reclaimed trail just to make sure that things are, are still stabilized and, and revegetating nicely. And what we found is that the trail has regrown in really well. Uh, crossings are doing quite well, they're stabilizing and sediment inputs into the stream are decreasing. Our initial monitoring of the fish population seems to show that it's responding well as well. So that's, that's all very positive signs so far. So bull trout are Alberta's provincial fish. Uh, they're also listed as threatened under both the Federal Species at Risk Act and Alberta's Wildlife Act. To thrive, they really need cold, clean, clear, connected water. And they're important because they're a canary in the coal mine for Alberta's watersheds. They're a good indicator of, of a healthy watershed and a healthy landscape. And when they start, uh, experiencing declines and being in trouble, that's an indication that, that there's other problems on the landscape. So really by caring for bull trout and providing good habitat for them, we're really ensuring that our watersheds are healthy and that our water sources are healthy. So generally speaking, when we come to uh, streams, we want to make sure we keep the wheels out of water by putting appropriate water course crossings in or reroutes. And in areas like this where we do have quite a few uh, crossings. We do reclamation efforts to help uh, direct folks on more of our high dry sites where we can enjoy what Albertans love doing, whether it's using off-highway vehicles, horses, you name it, um, because we understand recreation being a key part in um, people's uh, daily lives.